647 does not prohibit or restrict the study of adult stem cell research, which Representative Baker has said were more effective than embryonic stem cell research. The bill that my fellow caucus members and I strongly support and sponsor protects the rights of unborn children by clarifying the restrictions for the field of stem cell research. Although our opponents may say that Senate Bill 647 could limit the amount of research done on embryonic stem cells because of the extra paperwork, it is the responsibility of Michigan citizens to know what is going on behind the doors of these research facilities. By voting in favor of Senate Bill 647, you are supporting life. You are ensuring that the rights of the unborn are being defended. Vote for Senate Bill 647. Thank you. Thank you, Representative Van Lowe. We will now hear from Representative Brenner. Representative Van Lowe, the audience floor. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. My esteemed colleagues, would you knowingly vote for a bill that could result in death? Senate Bill 291, which I strongly oppose, is clearly an extremely hazardous bill. According to this bill, motorcyclists may choose whether or not they wear a helmet if they are over the age of 21. What if a young father riding a motorcycle with no helmet was killed instantly in a car, ac in a car accident that was not his fault? What if he could have been saved if he was required to wear a helmet? <coughs> How will the wife and children who leaves behind be provided for? How will his children be able to survive with no father to support them? This bill is just as dangerous to the family as it is to the individual rider. I urge my esteemed colleagues to defeat this unworthy and dangerous piece of legislation. Vote no on Bill 291. Thank you. Thank you, Representative Ben Lowe.